Nanotechnology is small, but just how small? Think about the bacteria we can't see with the naked eye, and then think even smaller than that. Because nanotechnology is the science of small things, and that is very small. A single human hair is approximately 100,000 nanometers wide. When you work in the nano field, you work with objects between 100 to 0.1 nanometers. When things get this small, they start acting differently, and materials acquire novel properties, and gravity seems irrelevant. Thanks to nanotechnology, we can design materials like we mix cocktails. With nanotechnology, we could revolutionize technology itself, because when technology gets smaller than single cells, it can become biological. We could, for example, construct tiny vessels smaller than human cells, which can travel in the body and deliver medicine at exactly the place where it's needed. Nanotechnology is promising, but also potentially hazardous. Because of their size, nanoparticles can get into living cells, and we do not know the full effect of this. Many decisions about the future of nanotechnology are made in laboratories, funding organizations and corporations. But what do you want from nanotechnology? Whether you're a citizen, a policymaker, a researcher, work in industry or with a civil society organization, your voice matters. The Go Nano project is about making sure nanotechnology develops to address your needs, interests and concerns. Make your own suggestion for an actual nanoproduct or nano solution for health, food or energy in collaboration with others. Go Nano is an EU funded project, a showcase of how researchers can work with public and professional stakeholders in creating novel suggestions for future nanotechnology products. Co-create with us at gonanoproject.eu. Take part in shaping the future.